Boltzmann Statistics and Ion Channel Statistics. We can think of an ion channel as a simple two-state system. It is either open or closed. By using the Boltzmann statistics and the Markov model, we are able to deduce the energy difference of the two states by measuring the average closed and open times of the ion channel. Firstly, the Markov model allows us to deduce the transition rate at which closed channels will open, and vice versa. By measuring the average time the ion channel stays open, and the average time it stays closed, we denote the transition rate from closed to open as k plus and open to close is k minus. By doing this, we assume that the rate is constant, meaning the ion channels are identical, and independent of time and position. Otherwise our equations would quickly become very difficult. The Markov model can also be used to investigate the transitions between states where the probabilities of transition are time independent. Using the Markov model we can derive the transition probability matrix T and the steady state probabilities, p infinity, which are given by one of the eigenvectors of this matrix. From here, we obtain the probability of the ion channeling the open and closed state independent of time. Next, we find the difference in energy of the two states ion channel using Boltzmann statistics. The Boltzmann statistics gives us a general formula for the probability of a particle, or channel, being in a given state, based on its energy. It assumes that there are a large number of states that are in thermodynamic equilibrium with each other, and that every possible state of the system is equally likely. This is called the principle of a priori probabilities. In the case of two state ion channels, the two different energy states are the open and closed states. The probability of finding an ion channel in a given state is given by 1 over z times the exponential of minus the corresponding energy over kt where z is the partition function in k is the Boltzmann constant. Henceforth, we have two equations from the Markov models and Boltzmann statistics, both giving us the probability of a given state, either open or closed. By equating both expressions, we are able to obtain an equation which relates the steady rates of change between open and closed states of the ion channels with their corresponding energies. Rearranging both resulting equations give us the energy of the open and closed states as a function of the steady rates of changes between the two states. Rearranging both resulting equations give us the energy of the open and closed states as a function of the steady rates of changes between the two states. The difference in energy can then be found. Recalling that the average time for the ion channel to remain closed or open is equals to the inverse of the rate at which transitions take place from closed to open or open to close respectively. We substitute it into the equation as well. Under thermodynamic equilibrium, the temperature and Boltzmann constant are constant. The difference in the energies are therefore solely dependent on the average open and closed times. Therefore, by measuring the mean open and closed times of two state ion channels, we are able to estimate the difference in the energies of the ion channel states using this equation.